Hello, crazies. I'm back again. And this time, my novel that I'm going to be discussing is a Lloyd Alexander novel. And you all know how much I love Lloyd Alexander. So, this one's going to be just a, a single single novel. And the, the next one's going to be a series review because I basically read both of them before I basically made a book review. I was only actually do two separate reviews, but say I read both both of the series, I do them together. But on to the main attraction, the main D that is Lord Alexander's The Boat Trick. This this novel I have really, really started to love Lord Alexander. I enjoyed the Black Culture in the movie. The the Disney anime movie. That basically kind of, from what I heard, kind of ripped the uh, books apart. But I still love it. I love the I love the movie. It, it it really it was fun. The, the movie is a fun movie, and I was like, you know what? I want to read the con the Concord Pendray one day. So I, that is my goal before I die. Is to not before I die, but. It, that is one of my goals to, one of my goals to read, a uh, reading is to read the Chronicles of Pendrain. Don't know when I would come to that goal, but that is one of my goals. But while I'm on that goal, I basically decided, you know what, I'm going to also start reading. If I see a Lloyd Alexander's book for like 50 cents or a dollar, I'm going to buy it and I'm going to read it. And that's basically what I've basically been seeing a lot in, uh, independent bookstores. I've been seeing a lot of Lloyd Alexander's novels and I've been picking them up, reading them, and they're fun. They're fun and light to read. I mean, this this novel is only 195 pages. That is so I basically read the book trick in basically a week. Cause I'm I'm I basically say I'm a slow reader. I I read almost every little detail in which I love. I love reading everything in detail. So that's why it only takes me about a week to read even a 195 page novel. I, I, I call it a novel. That's probably more of a novella. But that's just me. I, I, it takes me a week to read uh, even a short book. Unless it's a, unless it's a book that I've been wanting to read for a while and it's like 500 pages. I can read a 500 page novel in a week's time if it's a novel I really want to read. Like, um, The Demon King uh, by Cinder William Chang. I've been wanting to read that forever and ever. And when I do get a chance to read it, I got some other books I'm wanting to finish. I'm going to probably blaze through that book that I'm gonna, I've been wanting to read it so bad. Uh, same with The Rising, The Third Inheritance. Uh, the third book in the inheritance cycle. That I've been wanting to read, so I'll probably brace through that one. You know how big it is, I'm being blazed through. So it, it just depends on how how much I, how badly I want to read the book. Okay? And then we got so, but, but back to this book, back to the book trick. It's a fun, light read. Um, it basically, it's definitely kind of childish, but it's, it's short, it's cute, it's, it has historical backgrounds, and basically it's a group of carnival people. They basically go to town, town, performing, um, so basically she's a magician, and she performs magic tricks. And she's basically been trying to find this guy who has done this incredible trick called the rope trick. She wants to master the rope trick. And it's basically a trick that basically she, um, it, she, she wants to learn. And it's not really a fantasy not, novel, not, not really to the end. That's when it probably basically becomes a fantasy novel because of what happens at the end. I don't want to spoil it if you want to pick it up. But I'd definitely say if you're looking for a, a, a 
fun, light read. Then pick up the rope, rope trick by Lloyd Alexander because we won't be disappointed. It's definitely a, it's a nice, light read. And I would give it, I would give it four stars. This, it could have been done better. It could have been probably expanded a little bit and um, a little bit more explanation on some things. But in all, it was a great read. I, I'd have said that it could have been expanded a little bit, made it a little bit thicker, and made it a little bit more or less childish. But for a guy my age, I'm in my 20s. It is actually a very good read to relax. It is definitely a relaxing read. So, again, if you want a relaxing read, pick up The Rope Trick by Lloyd Alexander. And, this has been Rosario and Crazy, signing off. Live and, live and keep on reading. Bye.